Hey there, everyone. It is now the top of the hour, so I want to go ahead and get started. But before I do and bring in our guest, can I get a sound check and a screen check? Make sure that you can hear me clearly in your part of the world and see my desktop. Hi, Sean. All right, James. Yo, hey, James. I saw your email. Great day today. Hi, Hus. Hi, Yannick. Max, Danny, good evening. All right, good. Sounds good. Everything's good. Oh, hey, Nick. Good to see you. All right, let's go ahead and get started. And let's see what. Oh, okay. Yeah, great. Hi, Oz. All right, great. Um, I just want to do a couple um, admin reminders for everyone. There's uh, both mem active members in here, alumni, and also some new people. So welcome to all of you. Um, this presentation isn't just for active members. Clearly, it's for everybody. And I'm, I'm glad you made time to join us. I know <laughs> joining webinars sometimes isn't the best use of everyone's time. But uh, just a couple things for the me active members. Our July webinar schedule is today, obviously, the 7th, the 14th, and the 21st. There's a members-only Sunday newsletter that's sent to your inbox each week. Make sure you take a look at that. It's usually a quick two-minute, two to three-minute read to get you ready and primed and focused on the week ahead. The Start Here tab for members is an important hub inside the members area. And I just want to remind everybody about that. And then if you need help on anything or have any questions, support at priceactiontradersinstitute.com. And here is a, on the right-hand side of your screen, you should see this is the start here, start here area that I'm referring to. If you're brand new to the membership, this is where you want to focus and get a few things done up here. And then down here are the latest member announcements. So everything's down here. You can always find the newsletter to download if you, for some reason, don't get it in your email. Um, you can always find it here. You can also click here for the latest webinar training. So after today, this will be replaced with today's recording. All right. So. Um, Let's go ahead and move on because I know everyone's here not to hear me babble, but to hear from Atlas. So we're having a special presentation with a company called Blue FX out of London. And I want everyone to briefly meet Atlas McKenzie. He's going to be our presenter today. He's the head of marketing and brand strategy at Blue FX. And he's also happens to be a Forex trader. He's passionate about trading and he also has a leaning towards marketing. So when he discovered Blue FX, it seemed to be a great match for him. He's responsible for growing Blue FX and for creating more awareness about the new 21st century prop firms. The model is has changed. So we're going to hear about that today. He's going to show us, you, me, all of us, the benefits of using a prop firm to scale our income and to generate wealth. Atlas asked me if I could save the questions to the end, so he'd like to go through the presentation first, and then he'll, he will be more than happy to answer any and all of your questions. All right, so I'll, I'll go ahead and ask him the questions. All you have to do is type them in the chat box, and I'll take it from there. So let me get Atlas on here. Gonna hey, Kim. Uh, hello? There we go. Yep, you should be... You should be getting the thing to present. There we go. Okay, hello. Can um, everyone hear me? Let's do a sound check, yeah. Can everyone hear Atlas and also see his presentation? Yes, they can. I'm getting this. Okay, so they, so they can see blue effects up on the screen, yeah? Yep, they sure can. Okay. So can I. All right, perfect. I will um, get this cracking then. <laughs> Great. I'll um, go ahead and mute myself, but I will be here in the background. Okay. All right. Perfect, Kim. Thank you very much. Well, thank you everyone um, for actually joining me on this presentation. As Kim mentioned earlier, you know, some of these presentations can like be quite boring and go on forever. My aim is to really get through this as quick as possible for you, give you some highlights, let you understand exactly what we do here at Blue Effects and get to answering your questions because I think that's where um, the time is best spent. So just to make you aware, um, you know, 
Blue Effects, we think that we have or we provide a very simple solution to one of the biggest hurdles that holds traders back from achieving freedom, financial stability, and consistent account growth. But before we kind of like get into the core of the presentation, I think it's important to understand the problems that we all face as traders and these problems that actually encompass this hurdle, okay? So, you know, one of the problems that we actually have when we decide to jump into the market is actually, you know, getting, uh, you know, having enough money, right? So we could potentially decide to borrow money from friends and family. Uh, the only thing about that is that if you lose that money, you're going to have a very tough conversation, which could lead to tension with your family or even a possible breakup between friends, right? Then there's the problem of gambling and treating trading more like a casino rather than an actual business. And then we have the case of overtrading, right? And, you know, these all build up our emotions and you kind of like get into a state where you're like, all right, that's it. You use your full margin and then you have this go big or go home mindset which is one of the quickest ways at the end of the day to go and blow your account. Now, you could also start with a small account, maybe around $200 or $500, but it's really hard to um, you know, grow those kind of accounts as well, right? And especially if you wanna go down the investor route, it's pretty difficult to find investors that have, you know, when you have no track record, okay? And it's also hard to grow your account with limited capital. Um, then there's falling for, you know, get rich quick schemes, uh, bots and copy trading. You know, I'm sure we've all been there, right? And then there's the usual cases of holding on to losses, um, not taking profits, and generally just being broke because of forex because you know you're you're passionate about this industry you're passionate about this game and you're happy to throw money into it but you know when you keep on throwing money into something and it doesn't pay dividends you know at some point you're just going to have to either just throw in the tower or just completely give up now the biggest problem that we have discovered um, here at blue effects that most traders suffer from is trading with scared money okay um trading with money that you actually can't afford to lose so you know you're going into trades with big ambitions with every pip attached to hopes and dreams and when a trade doesn't work out it feels like your whole world has crumbled it's ended right but what do most people do they load up their account again with a couple hundred bucks or a couple thousand bucks and simply repeat the same cycle. Now, all of the problems I just discussed affect your emotions, which lead to the fragmentation and distortion of behavior when it comes to your trading. And when it comes to us as human beings, you know, flesh and blood characters, keeping our emotions stable is vital to the consistency of our growth. OK, but we can't do that if we're always thinking about the money that's in our account. All right. Now, this um, will affect how you manage your risk. It will affect how your ability to stick to your trading strategy. It will affect your profit and your loss ratio. OK, so the simple solution to this problem of trading with scared money is simply to stop doing it. OK, and we believe that if you have a fully funded trading account, it will allow you to relieve that tension that you're experiencing um, and allow you to trade free and clear without having to worry, oh, this money is going to go here or that money is going to go there. This bill has to be paid. That bill has to be paid. If you're trading money and you don't have to worry about the loss of that money, it allows you to free up your emotions and concentrate on exactly what you need to concentrate on, which is simply your trading strategy, okay?
Now, just before we get into stuff, get, before we get dive into the core of this presentation, is I think it's important to understand what blue effects are not. Okay, we are not brokers. All right, BlueFX is a trader discovery platform, and our aim is simply to find the best traders all over the world, give them money, let them trade, okay, and then let's split the profits. It's as simple as that. Now, regardless of whether or not you've um, been aware of this industry of prop trading or getting a funded account or not, I know there is always one question lurking in the back of your mind, okay? And that question is very simple. Do we actually pay our members, okay? Because we have a withdrawal target of 5%. And I think it's important that you know that if you get into an industry or you get in with a prop firm, that they are actually going to pay you once you hit your target, all right? So I've pulled a couple of um, screenshots from our Facebook group page, which you're more than welcome to go to after this and speak to our traders and anything like that at all, just to show you that we pay our traders every single month. So you've got Mohammed here, who's clearly says that he's received his payout. We've got Hack Nawaz. Um, thanks again to Blue Effects. I got my second withdrawal. Um, we've got Domenius who got paid out on the 25th of January. Again, first payout on his 5% for his Light account. We have Marco again, who's been paid out by PayPal. Um, we've got Belinda again, who's been paid out. She says, thank you, Blue Effects. Um, we've got Tapiawa, who's been paid out 10% for December. So that's awesome. He, um, he went above, over and beyond. Um, we also have Maruan who got paid out as well. He had a bit of an issue when um, he was getting paid out, but we sorted that out. And as you said, he would love to apologize to BlueFX team and thank them. Our support team is absolutely amazing and they'll make sure that they will always get you paid. Uh, we have Ron Chen. Again, we pay in BTC as well. Um, big thank you to BlueFX for my payout. Keep up the good job. Uh, Mohammed again, paid in BTC. Got his withdrawal today also. And KI Living, again, you know, got paid out. So I think that's just important to show you that, you know, if you do hit your 5% withdrawal target, you do get paid out. That is guaranteed. Okay. So let's actually take a deeper look into what we offer and the packages themselves. So a few of the highlights, all right. So you know, getting started with limited capital you makes means your your only fee and your risk is your monthly subscription fee, which is you know, it's it's basically like the cost of doing business. Okay, we have a monthly subscription, and that's that's your only risk. Okay, you, you got the the money that you trade with is you know you don't have to worry about the losses there. So your only risk is your monthly subscription fee. Um, you get the live MT4 trading account in 48 hours, okay? And that's after we receive your KYC form. Now, your KYC form is simply the information um, to send us so we know who you say you are. So it's like, you know, your driver's license or passport or identity card, whatever that may be, okay? Um, you know, we also wanted to avoid the usual time-consuming activities um, that other prop firms do. So there's no challenges, there's no demo trading, and there's no tests. You pay your subscription and you get instantly funded. OK, there's also no country restrictions and you can trade using your own strategy. Um, there's also no daily maximum loss limit at all. OK, and there's no restrictions on trading the news because at the end of the day, uh, we believe that news events trigger amazing opportunities in the market. OK. Um, and there's the 5% profit target, which can be achieved at any time, as long as you hold an active subscription, okay? And 10% at each stage triggers account growth. Now, you don't have to go for account growth, either when you hit the 10%, you can trigger a withdrawal, it's entirely up to you. And we'll go deeper into that in the next couple of slides, okay? You also have the ability to refinance your account when in drawdown for a small fee. Okay, we'll get into that deeper as well. Uh, now, you know, 
let's say that you know instead of five percent this month right you make seven percent so what happens to the other two percent that you've made all right your profit simply rolls over to the next subscription cycle so next month you'll only need three percent to hit your five percent withdrawal target okay now not only that you can also pause your subscription for up to six months and continue where you left off whether that's at a profit or a loss and we also have a number of payout uh, payment and payout options from simple bank transfers to crypto currencies okay so let's actually move on to the packages themselves so the $25,000 account light package okay as you can see that's 99 pounds per month and that's billed monthly and you can cancel at any time okay so as you can see on the left here not liable for any losses it's $625 per payout you get $75,000 of buying power no account growth on the light account you can hold overnight and you get 28 currency pairs and one metal being gold okay so traders will initially run a 25,000 book trade in the fx majors and minors you have leverage of three to one okay your you can hit you can trigger a withdrawal once you hit five percent our trading hours on the light account are 6 a.m to 9 p.m um, monday to friday london time okay because this is more or less a day trading account overnight positions are allowed but not over the weekends um, there is no hedging EO, eas or copy trading allowed reason being is that we are looking for the best traders okay we're not looking for the best traders who can follow a script or follow somebody else's signals and so forth okay we want the best traders on our books um, unauthorized positions will result in the termination of your subscription now i know this sounds you know a little bit out there but all this simply means is don't trade outside of the hours of 6 to 9 o'clock 6 to 9 p.m on the light account you know it's it's a business and as a business it's your responsibility to look after the business right traders will not be liable for losses caused by trading activity and there are no account increases available on the basic package and the following currencies can be traded as pairs and you can close your trades after 9 p.m modify your sl your, your stop loss or your take profit but you can't place a trade okay so let's move on to the pro account now everything really stays the same with the pro obviously there is account growth with the pro so you can take that to a million and we'll get into that just a little bit later on but the two major changes from the light to the pro is number one you got 24 hour trading monday to friday but all trades must be closed by 9 p.m friday night uk time and obviously with the pro account number one is 249 pounds per month and account increases are available on the pro account now you're probably looking you know you're probably looking at some of these parameters thinking you know it's a bit much so maybe these parameters may hinder me from doing this or doing that but our parameters are actually built to keep you as a trader in the game longer and let me give you an example of this because we actually received an email from one of our members recently that kind of like let us know that our parameters are on the right track in terms of helping keeping traders healthy um, while they're going through this process right so we got this email from jacob nystrom and it says i've spent more than enough time and he mentions a few prop firms here but you know we're not in the uh, game of you know naming everybody's trying to trying to you know do a good business here so you know we've, we've blacked that out and we said i've spent more than enough time in blah 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 prop firm dopamine disco um casino mix of being an idiot with my own money never again after my first day with you guys i am completely blown away at the difference your parameters made you have nailed the remote prop formula period the end don't change anything i feel like i'm actually trading now i'm not constantly worried or worse that i will never see my averages play out because i'm a very good market reader 
My poor brain is at peace after London closed because I'm not allowed to place more trades. Genius. I'm at peace because I don't have to watch the market every goddamn minute anymore because high leverage accounts have hijacked my brain. I feel like for the first time ever, my very good skills at reading the markets will actually yield real long-term results. Seriously, thank you. I've been through all the other prop firms, are close, but even then, after all I've been through to build my skills, starting at 0.01 lots was just not possible for me. To me, this is remote prop trading, nirvana, plain and simple. So, as I said, the parameters may seem a bit restricted. Yes, they do open up the further the stages that you go, but trust me, these parameters are here to keep you healthy, to keep you in the game longer, so you can actually progress to each of those stages um, to go to that one million fund manager status, okay? So, let's move on to the next slide, which is about the withdrawal process. So traders basically get to keep 50% of all profits if and only when a profit target of 5% is reached. Request for withdrawal can be made whenever the account balance is at its base balance of 25K or 50K plus 5% and the subscription is active. Okay. Withdrawals in blocks of 5% above the original balance are deducted upon request from the trading account. There are no limits on the amount of withdrawals made on a monthly basis and withdrawals are processed up to the 20th day of each month and payouts to the trader are made on the 25th of each month. And 50% of every account withdrawal is transferred to the trader's equity account and is held separately from the trading account. Now, your equity account will be in your dashboard when you actually sign up. OK, now the equity account itself acts as your own personal vault and it's there to safeguard your profits. So once you've requested a withdrawal, it means even if you hit your drawdown that month, you hit your drawdown limit on that month, you still get paid out. OK, so it's simply there to safeguard your profits so you can continue trading that month as you please. All right. Now, just to give you a visual representation, the profit share on a light account on 25K, so if you make your 5%, that's $1,250, 6.25 goes to the trader, 6.25 goes to blue effects. And just, you know, so if you make, you can make 5%, if you make 10%, if you make 15% that month, again, it's just a 50-50 split, okay? Um, and on the pro account, on the 50K account, you make 5%. That's 2,500, 1,250 goes to the trader, 1,250 goes to blue effects. Now, there is an overall drawdown limit that I mentioned earlier on on each account, and that drawdown limit is 10%, okay? So there's no daily limits or anything like that. There's just an overall drawdown limit on each account. So on the 25K account, your max drawdown at 10%, is 2,500, okay? And on the pro account, your max drawdown at 10% is $5,000, okay? Um, let's move on to the next slide, which is growth. Now, in order to grow, you must not withdraw the 10% at each stage, okay? So for each 10% that you make and don't withdraw, you'll be managing and trading larger funds in that order. So let me give you an example of this, okay? So you start, everyone starts at stage one, it depends. And so if you start at a 25K account, remember there is no growth on the 25K account. If you wanna go for those, um, for those larger stages, then you have to have the 50K account, okay? So at stage one, you can start on the $50,000 account and you need to make 10%, all right? So then if you, if you make that 10%, that's $5,000, okay? And you now have stage two, you now have access to 100,000 in capital, okay? So you make 10% on 50,000, you now have access to 100,000 in capital, okay? That's the stage two. So now you're on 100,000. If you make 10% on 100,000, we will then give you $200,000. Okay, so you make 10% on 50,000, we'll give you $100,000. You make 10% on that 100,000, again, without withdrawing the previous 
will give you $200,000. That means you now have net in your account $215,000 net, okay? Now, if you make 10% on $200,000, you now get access to $1 million in capital, and you are now a fund manager, okay? And that gives you, you that leaves you now at one million and thirty five thousand net. Okay. So again, just to reiterate, at stage one, if you hit ten percent, you get a hundred thousand dollars. At stage two, you hit ten percent again, you get two hundred thousand dollars. Stage three, hit ten percent again, you get one million in capital. Now, if you decide to trigger the profit split on the fifty k account, which is a total of five thousand at ten percent. It means Blue Effects will receive 2,500 and you will receive 2,500 into your equity account, which means you will stay on the 50,000 account rather than progressing to the larger account. Okay, so let's have a look at some of the promotional benefits that you get. So there is no increase in monthly fee for any of the promotion stages. Stage two promotion earns removal of the 0.5 order cap. Okay, stage three promotion earns 24 hour trade opening, no weekend position holding. And stage four promotion earns weekend position holding and removal of 5% withdrawal minimum and no monthly subscription. So once you get to the million pound account, you don't have to pay a monthly subscription anymore. And there is a removal of the 5% withdrawal minimum. So if you do 1% that month or you do 2% or you do 3%, you can withdraw 50% of that particular percentage, okay? So let's just move on to the loyalty benefits. Now, all traders with six months continuous subscription and without unauthorized trades or drawdown breaches on record will be granted all the benefits of stage three promotion plus the ability to hold positions over the weekends. So if you have a six month continuous subscription with us to show us your loyalty, you'll get stage three benefits that you just saw, okay? Um, no matter what account you're on, whether you're on the 25K or whether you're on the 50K, okay? So I think that's really, really cool um, for our loyalty benefits. So, you know, at this point, we've gone into most of everything that you really need to understand. If you have any questions, again, please just keep them aside um, and I'll answer them in one moment. But I really want to discuss in terms of like how you guys can actually get started. Um, I think Kim is going to have a link for you guys at the end of the presentation. And when I get to the end of the presentation, there's going to be a little bonus in it for you as well um, that you'll only be, only be able to get from Kim's link. Now, when it actually uh, comes to getting started, um, it's really, really simple, and there's really no need to complicate this, guys, right? You simply go to the Blue Effects website, and Kim's link will actually take you here. And all you have to go is go and click on the Login and Sign Up button. It's really, really simple. Then once you click the Sign Up button, insert your name, details, email, password, referral code if you have one, and you know that will get you signed in then this is what your dashboard will look like. And then you'll decide what account you wanna go with, either the light or the pro account. Now, once you've chosen what account you wanna go with, you just have to click next. So if we've gone for the light account and you simply pay your subscription. Now, once you've paid your subscription, you'll get an email that um, basically is called your KYC. I, I mentioned that earlier, where you just have to simply prove who you say you are with your full name, address, either photo ID, passport, driver's license, whatever that may be. Now, the quicker you get your KYC to us, okay, is the quicker that we can process your application. As I said, there's no demo challenges, there's no trials, there's no you know, exams or having to prove anything to us. You pay your subscription, you get instantly funded. But the KYC can sometimes slow the process down if you don't send the right documents or something like that, right? Now, you, you actually send these documents inside the dashboard. So you just simply click on choose a file, send your document, and once you've got it, we'll process your application. Now, sometimes the only thing is that if you do send us your documents, make sure that you shrink the files because if they're too large, it won't register. Okay, so just remember that. And all you have to do is click on profile to get to this tab. 
okay? Now, once you've done that and your KYC has been processed, you'll simply then get an email that looks like this. And it will have your username, trader guidelines, and a link to download the MT4 platform through our broker um, for your desktop or your Android or your iOS device. And once you're at this stage, you're actually live to start trading. And it's really, really simple. As I said, the quicker you can get your KYC to us, the quicker we can get you sorted out. And we can literally get you an account within a few hours of actually signing up. It's just a KYC process that can sometimes um, take a bit of time sending in the wrong documents and so forth. So I guess now we're at the end of the presentation. And I really just want to, um, number one, let you know that you know, it's been brilliant speaking to you guys. Can't wait to hear some of your questions. But the bonus that um, Kim has aligned for you is basically you get 1% added to your account um, depending on what package you buy. So if you decide to go for the light subscription package, um, you'll so that's, that's starting off at 25,000, you will now be starting off at 25,000. 250 and if you decide to go for the pro package so you'll be starting at fifty thousand five hundred dollars so you can only get that offer through kim's link so i guess you'll be sharing it around here somewhere to you guys if you're interested please go to the website please check it out please go to our facebook page and you know see anything that we have there please go to our facebook page and ask any of our traders how they're doing, whether they get paid out, they'll more than happily help you in your journey of getting started. And if you have any questions for me here today, please put them in the box and we'll go over them right now. Thank you for um, your time and I hope you enjoyed the presentation. Hey Atlas, thank you very much. Um, I know I have a couple questions. Um, can you <laughs> No problem. Um, yeah, well, I mean, this this plays really well along with how we trade here because we are truly day traders and we don't hold positions overnight and we never hold over the weekend. So uh -huh. one of the questions that um, is coming in right now is what are the spreads like on your MT4? And I think that's a uh, good the one. Spreads, the, spread, the spreads are really good. Recently, they've just been reduced by our broker as well. So you're looking at sort of like, depending on, obviously the spreads vary depending on what um, what peers you're trading. But for instance, mm -hmm. on the pound yen, our spread is like 1.5. Wow, on that's Euro, great. It's like, yeah, on Euro USD, you're looking at about a pip or just below a pip. Um, okay. Obviously, through news events, as you probably you know, know that mm -hmm. sometimes the um, the spread fluctuates while a news event is happening, but apart from that, our pip, um, our spreads are really good. Great. And does the does the broker that you we trade through charge commissions also to go in and out? No, they're a STB okay. broker, so it goes straight through. Okay, perfect. Great. Um, all right. So a couple, a lot of questions on the. <laughs> Can we place our? Uh, any trading template on just like any MT4 platform, can we do that on yours? Um, what, what do you mean by a template? I'm, I'm not sure what you mean. Um, just certain, like we have an Asian box, what we call prior days high and low, just to make oh, our charts how we read them. Yes, 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 yes. You okay. can do that. It's just that you can't use any sort of like bots or, you know, signals yes. or anything no, like that. But yeah, that's that. totally fine. That's totally fine. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, great. Um, Liam asks, to grow the pro account, do you have to hit the 10% target within a single month or is it just whenever you reach that 10%? It's whenever you reach that 10%, Liam. There is there is no there is no time restrictions for you to hit anything at any specific time. But this is why this is why we run a subscription model because we don't want to put any pressure on you to do anything in a certain amount of time because that pressure, um, you know, reduces your mental stability. So you can complete that 10% or that 5% at, at any time you like, just as long as you hold an active subscription. Great. Um, Mikhail asks, who's behind BlueFX? How long have they been around? And some background info, which is on their yeah, website. Blue, but yeah, go ahead and give us yeah, the no, 411. No problem. Um, BlueFX has been around for now 
um, I think around seven years because I've, jo- I've only been with Blue Effects for the past two years. Blue Effects started as an original, like as, as a prop firm. You know, they had people come into the office, uh, they'd pay for a desk. Um, it would cost them around five thousand pounds per student. Um, that student would then trade a demo account, and then they'd, depending on how well they're doing a demo, then they'd, or they'd give them money to trade with. But what our founder, um, Yu Song, um, found, discovered is that once they've left the demo account, um, their trading deteriorated once they got real money. So he wanted to find a solution to this and found it in the technology. And this is the model that he came up with. So it's been around for seven years now, but it's only, I guess, well, I, I don't want to sort of like, you know, float my own boat, but I think it's, it's since I just started, we've been getting out there a hell of a lot more, you know? So, um, mm-hmm. yeah, our numbers have definitely risen over the past two, two and a half years. Yeah. Uh, hey, Yash, nice to see you. Yash asks, is there a growth benefit for the 25K account like there is for the 50K? No, there isn't. The 25K account stays as is. You can only take growth if you start on the 50K account. And you can also, so let's say, for instance, you know, you start on the um, 25K account. Um, If you want to uh, move on to the 50K account through your subscription, then all you have to do is pay the 150 and you can move up to the other account if you wish. Great. Um, Here's my question. What happens if a trader hits uh, the maximum drawdown? What, What happens to them? What do you do to them? Like okay, so off the group or no, no, not at all. So <laughs> if, a, if a if a trader hits the maximum drawdown, yep. then um, they can simply refinance their account for a fifty pound charge, and that will okay. bring them back to uh, back back to their um, starting balance again. Okay, so if they lose ten percent, is that correct? I understand the drawdown line in the yep. sand, so to say, is ten percent. Yep. Okay, and so if they reach that, then they just pay 50 pounds and get it re back refinanced re- back to the yeah, original refinanced. balance yeah. okay yeah, yeah that's good got to know about the downsides yeah of course yes. of course i mean don't yeah. get me wrong the um the account will be assessed by the risk team as long as there hasn't been you know like you know real dangerous activities in terms <laughs> of the way that person's been trading then yes. they'll more than happily refinance the account for a for 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 a, for a simple for simple fee of 50 pounds yeah, great. All right, um, Shy Group, any more questions? Um, I put the link in there. Hopefully, you all can see it. And remember, like um, Atlas told us, that if you do decide to move forward with this, you'll get a little bump of one percent added to your account to begin the begin your prop firm trading experience. Yeah. Kevin yeah, wants yeah. to know: Can you tell us who the broker is? Yeah, the broker is called Eternity Global. They're in Australia. Also, I know you and I talked about this, Atlas. I just want to reinforce this with our U.S. traders because there's a lot of them in here. And we can avail ourselves of this. So we don't have to be concerned about this. Sorry, Sorry, say that again, Kim? Yeah, so as US traders, we can avail ourselves of this program. We don't we're not limited by the traditional regulations. No, not at all. Not at all. Not at all. We've we've got plenty of US traders on our books. Um, you know, they absolutely love us once they once they discover us. So yeah, you guys are totally fine. Liam wants to know if we're trading our own capital, can we use a trade copier to copy trades from this to our blue FX account? Um, no trade copies are allowed, no. Yep. Yep, Mohammed, I just ans- asked that question about U.S. traders. Yash says, is that 50 pounds, one charge? You mean yeah, the... So it... Yeah, go ahead. Oh, the refinance. Yeah, so yes. the refinance. So let's say you, let's say this month you decide to... Um, let's say this month you're on 50k and maybe you're down you maybe you're down a thousand dollars you think to yourself do you know what I want to go back to square one you can um, do a 50 pound refinance and let's say two weeks later from there you know you're down maybe 1500 or 2k and you think oh do you know what I want to start from fresh again you can do a 50 pound refinance you're more than happy to do that 
So you don't have to wait until you've got to maximum drawdown in order to refinance your account and bring it back to your starting balance. Right. And Huss, you heard there's no commissions. Uh, Sean asks, what's the risk per trade of the account? The risk per trade is entirely up to you. So, you know, it, it's, it's entirely up to you. If you want to risk a hundred pounds, you want to risk a thousand pounds, depending on how wide you want to have your stop loss, that is entirely up to you. We just have a simple maximum 10% drawdown limit on the whole account. Yep. The rest is entirely up to you. Right, which makes sense. I assume, uh, Yannick says, I assume the account size is USD or what dollar yes, is it? It's, it's, yes, it's USD, yes, yes. Uh, Nick, he already answered that. Maybe, hopefully you heard about broker spreads and commissions. There's no commissions and the spreads are in line. Rich says, hi, Rich. Uh, can we pay in U.S. dollars the fee? Because we've got, we've got a lot dollars. of U.S. people here. Yeah, you can, you can, well, you can pay in U.S. dollars, but obviously it will be tr um, translated. Converted. So, yeah, it will be converted into what it costs in pounds, which is 249 pounds. Yeah. Dean says, can I get a GBP account? No, everything is in USD. Everything's USD. Yeah. Yeah. So Patrick, lot size per trade is up to you, the trader. Yannick says, is this available to Canadians? Yes, it is. It's available yes, to anyone around the world, right, Atlas? Yeah, it's, it's, yeah, it's a it's, it's a global, uh, we have global yeah. reach. So no matter where you, I mean, we've got traders in Afghanistan, um, traders um, in Peru, traders in Barbados, Jamaica, you know, we've got traders from absolutely everywhere, even countries that I've never even heard of before. Sean says, is that spread betting for UK tax? He's probably not going to answer that. No, it's, no it's, 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 <laughs> not, it's not, it's definitely not spread betting, yeah. no. So um, okay. yeah, you would have to sort out your own taxes um, once, you know, once that money starts coming in. And obviously for each region we're in the world, that's, you know, totally different. So I guess you're going to have to find that out within your, with, with your own um, government bodies. Right. Danny says, so what's the downside? Hey, let me try to take a chop at it. Well, <laughs> what I see is the downside is that if you go past the max drawdown, you'll have to contribute money to reset the account. Mm-hmm. Um, you have to pay a fee to access this large sum of capital, which to me isn't really a downside. It's just a cost. Yeah. Um, sounds like the spreads um, are not going to be an issue for us because we are day traders, Atlas, mm -hmm. and how we trade, we have to, and we use very tight stops. So yep. we, we need a tight stop brokerage. We don't mind paying commissions usually, but mm -hmm. ideally we need tight stop, tight Yeah commissions i mean no commissions tight spreads sorry i can't yeah no, yeah there's there's no commissions so, and there's definitely tight yeah, spreads I mean, exactly. as, as, so, as, as you mentioned i mean the only the only downside is literally those two things um but you know uh if, if you consider your monthly subscription you know just a, a part of doing business you know it's just like if you decide to open up a shop storefront you'd have to pay rates fees business fees you know store fees all these type of fees um this is simply just the cost of doing business to get access to the account and that is your only risk plus the 50 pound refinance fee if you decide you want to you know refresh back to your starting balance apart from that um you know everything is good yeah yeah, so really, I mean, I, I don't know what the big downside is other than the cost of doing business, cost to access capital. Yeah. Um, really. Um, but I don't really consider that a downside. No, it's, it's, it's not. I wouldn't consider that a downside. I mean, the only just... downside I see is that if you're a rogue trader or you're just a trader who doesn't take into account that you have a max drawdown, that – Yeah. Um, you could get yourself into a little bit of trouble. But even still, um, it's only 50 pounds to reinstate the account. So I don't know. Yep. Elise says, did you see my question to combine this with what we do with you? Not sure. Do you mean the question about is BlueFX regulated? I don't know. 
they're not a broker, so I, I don't know. What's the answer no, to that, Atlas? No, we're, we're not a broker. Um, our, 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 our broker is regulated, though. Yep. Okay. In Australia. Yeah. Um, so, Elise, did I, hopefully, I didn't miss any other part of your question. Um, Yash asked, do you have UK based customer service or outside? Yes. UK? Yes. It's, yes. Uh, it's, it's all UK. UK based customer service. Yep. So we basically run our shop from where we're available to answer any questions um, between the hours of 9 to 5.30 UK time, Monday to Friday. And, um, you know, if, if we're not available, which we, we won't, most likely won't be after those hours, I'm sure if you come to our Facebook group, um, you know, one of the traders or one of the members there who are actually paying and active members will happily answer any questions. But if you want to speak to somebody in support, um, you know, then we're available anytime between 9 and 5.30. And we do have our own moderators that are on our Facebook group as well that will also happily answer any of your questions. After Rich, those uh, oh, sorry. No, it's fine. That's it. Um, Rich says, I, I don't know if this is a question, based on your leverage, three full lots would be the total open at one time. Um, it's around um, it's around one lot, depending on the pairs that you trade. Like for instance, if I decided to open up to, um, this, is, this is only on the 50K account, as you move up stages, the, uh, the, uh, the lot cap gets removed. So, you know, for instance, if I wanted to place two trades at 0 0.50 lots, I'd probably be able to only be able to open two trades um, at that position size. So it just depends on what trades, um, what pairs you're trading and how much the margin allows for those pairs. Okay. Michaela says, I'm in the UK. Do you pay to my UK bank account? Yes, we do. So you can get paid, you can get paid to your UK bank account, you can get paid to PowerPal, you can get paid to your crypto wallet, whatever is easiest for you. And for US traders or anywhere else, they just get paid to their bank account, correct? Yeah, that's yes. correct, yeah. You uh, usually put that information in. Um, Hus, he said you're free to set your own lot sizes based on their restriction in total yeah. leverage. Yes. So. Yeah, yeah, you can set your own lot size per trade. Gene says, at what point do you determine that the particular trader is not one of the best and no longer eligible to be part of BlueFX? Um, that's not decided by us at all. I mean, if you do, the only the only way, the only the only real way for our risk team to deem you not eligible is if, for instance, you're doing something that is not within our parameters. Otherwise, you know, if you want to go and risk your whole account in one day, more than happy to. But <laughs> we may not finance, we may not refinance you because we know that you have the potential to do that again. Um, you know, it's something that will be considered by our risk team, but you know, there's no one who's gone and lost 10% in a day. So, um, you know, it'd be, it'll be highly impossible to even do that, but, um, it's, it's impossible to do it generally, but, um, but yeah, there's, there's not much apart from just totally being oblivious to our parameters, um, which is simply just trading outside of ours, to be honest with you okay. on the light account. So in other words, Gene, you have to be pretty bad. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, Danny asks, may we use this Blue FX account that we're trading in to copy to another account? So can we use it as the master? Um potentially. What? I'm not sure, but like that's that's I'll I'll have to get back to you on that one, Kim. Potentially, I'm not yeah. sure. Yeah, okay. Elise, it says you have to delete any previous MT4 and BlueFX uses its own plat. BlueFX uses its own platform. So how can we combine with what you do? I'm not sure. Where does it say on the website, Elise? Do we have? We don't. We don't. Just because we're using BlueFX's MT4 doesn't mean we can't use any other MT4, right? No, you can use your own yeah. MT4 account. It's yeah, just that yeah, you obviously you need to. Now you need to open up obviously another MT4 account via our link using our broker. So that that's only because obviously you you can have your own MT4 account as well. Yeah. Okay. Um, Sunny asks, 
hi, why account types in dollars, but subscription fee is in pound? Um, I guess that's just because we're in the UK, but mostly around the world, everybody uses dollars. It's the, it's the, yes. it's the, it's the world currency, right? Yeah. So our payout in a 25K account USD of 5% target is 625 minus the subscription fee, right? So, so it's so you you get paid out six hundred and twenty five dollars. However, if you wish to pay um, your subscription fee out of your profit, you can do as well. Oh, okay, that's good to know. So it's not my so it's not six hundred and twenty five minus your um, subscription fee. Your subscription fee is obviously what you pay on a monthly basis. So you get six hundred and twenty five dollars paid out to you. But if you decide to oh you think to yourself oh well do you know what I'd rather pay it I'd rather pay that subscription fee for my profits. You can just request it and you'll get your six twenty five minus your subscription fee. Got it. John F says, can you explain the leverage requirement? Um, what, what, what does he mean by that? Um, three to one means that you will require $33,000 US to control one lot, question mark. Um, I'll, what I can do is just, I can give you some information after this that will answer all of those questions. I just don't have all of that to, um, to detail okay. at the moment. Yeah, you can email me it and I'll just get it out to everybody. Yeah, no problem, we will do. So Kim, if you have six open positions, your lot size will be very small. Yes, I assume yes. that on a small account. Yes. Yeah. Definitely. Until you get up to the million dollar. And then is it after you get up to like if you go up to stage two, a hundred K, then there's no is there any cap on that there? No, you there's there's remove uh, you, you the zero point five order cap is then removed. Okay. And in order to get up to stage two, you just have to show what kind of growth on the 50K, 10%? So yeah, you just need, so you need 10% on the 50K to get to the 100K. And yeah. if you want to grow to the 200K, then you've got to remember, you've got to keep that initial 5K in that you've made. Yep. Yep. And then on the 200K, you then um, have to make another 10%. Okay, so then that will give you that will give you 10 grand. So you have 15 grand total now. And then from the 200k, you need to make another 20%. Sorry, another 10%. And then that will be 20 grand. So you'll have 1,035,000 net. And that will bring you up to the $1 million, um, $1 million account. And just to let you know, if you guys check out our YouTube channel, there's an interview that we did with one of our traders called Amir um, from Birmingham. He actually managed to get to the million pound account in three months. Beautiful. Which is, which is absolutely amazing. One of our previous traders um, did it in six months, um, but three months has, uh, has been our, our, you know, our quickest so far from 50K to um, 1 million. Obviously, the reason why, is, as he mentioned in the interview, he did nothing but eat, sleep and trade. Um, but once you start getting up to the larger accounts, then and using um, obviously higher lot sizes and managing your risk, you know it's a lot easier to get those to hit those numbers and those targets um, once you get up to those larger funds. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, so let's. I mean, I, I know people are asking questions about lot sizes and so forth, but really, if you have access to capital they're going to obviously control the lot size and and they rightfully should but that's like a huge benefit for most traders and most you know traders don't have access to capital that's the yeah. truth yeah um so uh fa z asks can i use skrill or paypal to get paid yes you can use paypal okay great yannick says i use an ea for order execution. I know he said there was no EAs allowed, Yannick. So is that true? Even for yeah, order no, execution? No, yeah. yeah, no EAs allowed. I mean, you can, uh, I mean, if you want to do an order execution, you can use like a stop limit or a buy limit or a sell mm -hmm. limit. Um, yeah. Yeah. So you can use pending orders, everything you can do on a just plain MT4 account. Yeah.
James says this isn't a question. You could use the PIP calculator to calculate. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I mean, it's what I suggest everyone do. It's how I come up with my own lot sizes. Rich wants to know how many people do you have at a million dollar account size? Do you know? Yes, we currently have eight people on the million account. Wow, lovely. And it, it's, oh, it's, it, it's, you know, it's, uh, it's, it's one of those, uh, it, it takes, it takes real dedication to get there. Um, you know, it's not easily done. I mean, Amir hitting it in three months, he's kind of like an outlier. Uh, you know, we've never seen anything like it before. Um, but you know, if, if you, if you've got the stamina and you know, you're more than willing to hold out and, you know, stick to your rules, stick to your old training plans, it's definitely possible. Yeah, you have to build. You have to be a builder. Um, Gene asks, are the lot sizes the same like they are with Oanda, standard, mini, micro? I'm assuming they are, or no? Yes, yes, yeah. yes, yes. So minis and micros and... Yeah, okay. Um, Elise asks, will I be the account owner of the funds I put in? You're not putting in any funds. Yeah, you're not putting in any funds. You're, you're just paying, paying a the subscription, subscription. Yeah, to get to access have to access to capital. And if you have to reinstate your account because of a over ten percent drawdown, then no, that's just the you know facilitation to access the capital back. So think of this as your. You're having an opening here to actually for the really good patty traders. And I know there's a lot of you in here because just based on yesterday, you know how to take advantage of the moves, right? So there's some days like today was like, you know, crummy in the New York session. It wasn't very much. But just think of the days that you can capitalize on the market with your skill and you have access to a much bigger account than maybe you do with your own funds, unless you're trading family funds or friends and stuff. So it's, it's a great way to get you into a position to take you out of risking like Atlas started off with, what are the biggest obstacles trader face? And one of it's trading with scared money. And a lot of you, well, I shouldn't say a lot of you, some of you in here that I know, you're trading scared. In fact, you yeah. use your line in the sand to hold you back on days when you should be stepping on the gas. So just food for thought. I'm not saying it's for everyone, but it's it's a great opportunity. I mean, what's the downside again is the subscription fee to have access to capital. Huss wants to know, do you provide a trader statement at the end of the year or month for tax purposes? No, that's all up to you. Yeah. It's as as I said, it's 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 like a business, you know. So um, when it comes to having your own business, um, you know, you have to look after your own taxes and and what you're getting paid and so forth. Right. Um, Elise, what are what are, when are you, oh, when, when I talk about, I think this is what you're asking me, trading scared, trading with scared money is money you like, you're so afraid to lose. You don't want to be, you know, losing more than X amount of money in your account because it's your rent money or God knows what it is. Your wife gave it to you or husband gave it to you. So it's called scared money because you're really not free to trade versus having access to funds that aren't yours. Um, with an overall limit of a 10% drawdown, you know, you have some flexibility in there and you can kind of be free to trade that money. Now, if you make money, great. But if you don't make money, you know where your, you know, weakness is and you either improve or you just say, you know what, I, this is too much. I don't want to even pay the monthly. Okay. Yeah, I think, I think that's, that, that's a good point, Nick. I mean, at the end of the day, like, I mean, if we, even if you, someone started off with like the 99 pound account, um, you know, it's it's for for a lot of people. You know, that's something they could literally spend on a weekend for a couple of drinks at the pub or out at a restaurant. That would live literally give you access to twenty five thousand to trade with. 
and you know trading with scared minds i think is what is one is it's a major problem because people have this dream you know they've been showing it on social media they're seeing the people with the flash cars the flash lifestyle and once somebody jumps into something like this you know they think that they were going to be turned to it they think they're going to be able to turn like 500 dollars into like half a million in the space of a couple months um and then the reality slowly kicks in right um but in this in, in this case with blue effects and the packages that we offer you know it just it, it takes the pressure off you know so you don't have to worry about trading even five thousand or ten thousand or one thousand or twenty five thousand of your own money which you could potentially lose which you worked extremely hard for now you can risk that restaurant money for that for that week and use it to actually create more of an income that can um you know greatly benefit or be an addition to your current income or your current job and if you want to step it up a level um you know yes you can trade for income but then when you got when you step it up on other accounts that's really when you start trading for wealth and you know you start growing your accounts to the 100k 200k levels um, you know, even if you don't want to say, for instance, you want to stay at the 100K, that's totally fine. 100K and you're hitting 5% or 10% a month on 100K, that's that's a lot of money um, for anybody uh, personally, right? And um, if you go to the 200K account and you're hitting 5% or 10% on 200K every single month, you know, that's a good income. And then you can go and potentially invest some of that in income, whether it be into cryptos or stocks or, you know, long term yielding stocks or cryptos or anything like that to generate um, long term wealth for you, your family and your family's family. Um, but it just depends on what sort of mindset that you're in. If you want just, you know, general income, then yes, you can achieve that. But if you want to build wealth as well, as well as build maybe like a daily income, you can also do that. It just depends on what sort of mindset you're in and where you want to take it. It's entirely in, in, in your hands. Yep. Uh, yes, Rich. Uh, James says, so the Australian broker doesn't send us a statement. No. Probably not because we're not their client, James. Yeah. Blue FX is their client. Um, Muhammad says one can start directly at stage one, the 50K. Yep. What's the fee for that again? It's uh, okay. So, so for the light account, it's um, 99 pounds per month, which gives you access to $25,000. And the pro account is the $50,000 account. And to get access to that, you pay 249 pounds per month. Yep. And Yash um, says, can you make the transition from 25 to 50? Yes. Remember, go ahead and yes. say it again, Atlas. Yeah you, yeah, you can. So let's say in the middle of the month, you think to yourself, do you know what? I want to upgrade to the pro. Then all you have to pay is 150 pounds because you've obviously paid the 99. Um, you pay 150 pounds, then you'll get access to the 50K account or you just wait till the end of the month and then just pay the 249 for the new account for the 50,000 account. Can you also take profit to 50K, Yash says? I'm not sure what that means. I'm not sure what that means either. Okay. Um, so when it comes to taking profits, you have to hit 5%, okay, in 5% blocks. So as I said, let's say in the first two weeks, you make 5% on your 50K account. You can then withdraw that 5% and obviously that stays in your equity account and that brings you back to the starting balance of 50,000 again. And then you can continue trading knowing that on the 25th of that month, you're going to get paid out. Um, you're going to get paid out what's, what's in your equity account. And in order to move between stage one and two, though, correct me if I'm wrong, Atlas, you hold back on taking a withdrawal? Is that correct? Yes, that that that, that that's correct. Yes. So so in order up. to so, so in order to move on to stage two, yep. um, you need to make number one. You, you need to make ten percent, okay, and then you need to make sure that you don't withdraw that ten percent. Um, otherwise, you know, it will just be a simple fifty-fifty profit split. But if you keep that ten percent in your account and then request to be upgraded, 
you'll, they'll, you'll then get access to 100K in capital and you have to keep that 10% in in order to get access to 100,000. Right. Um, so, so, sorry, so just to interrupt. So, so what you're yep. basically doing on the way to the million is kind of like building yourself a $35,000 buffer, right? So, you know, once you've once you've completed 10% at each of those stages, you've basically built yourself a $35,000 buffer that will be in that million pound bracket. So you'll be sad that and once you hit a million, you always have one million thirty-five thousand dollars. Got it. Yeah. So stage one, 10%, 5K, hold it. You get yep. to stage two, another 10%, that's 10 more K, hold it. Yep. You get to stage three, you make 10% on that. That's 20K, so you add them 5, 10, 20, that's your 35. Yep. Now you're in the million dollar account size. That's correct, yes. Okay. Um, so Gene says, how are year end income statements produced? They aren't. Um, and even I, the UK doesn't have things like we do here, Gene, like 1099s and so forth. So it's going to be up to us to report that. Any payouts that we take? Michaela says, can I just, can I stop to 100K and just keep drawing profit at that 100K? Yes, you can. There is, yeah, if you, you can, you can do that at 100, you can do that at 50K, you can do that at 100K, you can do that at 200K. There is, if you don't want to hold that 10% to move up to 200K or once you hit 100, if you, let's say you're, you're on 100K right now and you make 10% that month, um, you can decide to either, you know, decide and say, hey, do you know what? I want to go up to stage three, or you can just do a 50-50 profit split of, on 10% on, uh, of 200K and that's it. So you don't have to move up the levels if you don't want to. You can just keep on withdrawing and withdrawing and withdrawing every single month. Yep. Rich says they're not reported, Gene. <laughs> yeah, it's coming from overseas. <laughs> hey, let's be like all the wealthy Billionaires in the U.S. Taxes? What are those? <laughs> <laughs> Rich says if you make five thousand on a fifty k account and then lose five k, will you be done? Well, Sorry, did you take the withdrawal? If you took the withdrawal, you just back to you know fifty. Yes, if, if if he's on the hundred k account and decides to and, and and make so so if he makes the fifty k account, uh, if, on the fifty k account, if he decides to go for the ten percent, makes ten percent, and then moves on to the hundred k, um, but then he he thinks to himself, okay, do you know what? I don't really want to trade the hundred k account. I'd rather get the profit split. If he takes the profit split, then that would bring him back down to the fifty k account. All right, we got a big thinker in here. Dean says, when you hit stage four, can you, in the million dollar account, can you withdraw the 35K you've accumulated? So if you withdraw the, so if you decide to do a profit split on the 35K, that will bring you back down to the 50,000 account, but you can, but I, I feel that if you got to that stage, you should definitely continue because <laughs> it's, it's hard enough just getting there. So if you've got to there, I don't think you want to withdraw that because there's plenty more of that where that came from at that stage. Okay. Yeah, Muhammad, the qualifying process from moving between stages is you have to make at least 10% and you can't do a profit split with them. You just hold it, roll into the next stage. Okay. And you keep rolling it all the way if you want to go up to the million dollar account size. That might be scary for some people. I've traded million dollar accounts before in Forex. It's very interesting. Mm, it's it's a it's, it's another psychological barrier. Yes. Um, but once you've uh, once you get there and you pass that psychological barrier, then you know literally the world is your oyster. Right. Yeah, so um, a lot of good questions. 
Yeah, amazing questions. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. Yana, okay, one more, and then we'll cut it off here because I realize okay. um, it's past the hour, and you probably have <laughs> life. Um, does the growth? No it's been amazing. <laughs> does the growth reset? For instance, if I reach three percent in one month, can I do seven percent the next month and qualify for stage two? If so you don't, if he, yeah, so he if does three percent in month one. Is this on stage one on the 50k account? Yes. Yeah, so if he does 3% on month one, then he hasn't even qualified for the withdrawal target because the withdrawal target is 5%. Okay, but if he does 3% on month one, then it means that on month two, that rolls over. So all he needs to hit his 5% is to get another 2%. And then he's at, then he has then he's able to hit his withdrawal target because the withdrawal target is five percent, but to move up to the next stage is ten percent. Yes, and if you want to move, you know, to a bigger account, then obviously you're gonna go for that ten percent growth and hold it to get into the next level. But if you don't, I mean, I get it. If you only want to trade at 50,000, I mean, I only, that's a lot of money for most traders, 50,000. Yeah. You can hit your withdrawal at 5%, which will cover your monthly yep. fee, and you'll get a little profit. Or you can challenge yourself. Hey, I got a question. What? Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, I said no more questions, but in what happens profit. if <laughs> in month one, you hit uh, 10%, and you take you take a withdrawal mm -hmm. and that means you stay on the 50k account yeah you stay in the 50k account okay yeah i yeah. forgot what my but, question was that wasn't it but anyway okay. <laughs> <laughs> i'm losing my mind too all right <laughs> um yeah james says we're going to need some mindset training for this blue for blue fx challenges yeah no problem no problem all right everyone there's a lot of thank you thank you um good food for thought yes huss um it is good food for thought think about it seriously yeah it's uh, um, and, and just just remember everyone as well that if um just remember to if, if you go through kim's link which it's, no doubt she'll be able to send to you after this um you'll get an additional one percent added to your account whenever you're ready to start yeah and again you know the downside is very restricted so just consider it yeah. You don't have to do it today or tomorrow. Um, maybe it's something you want to do in a month from now. Who knows? Anyway. Exactly. Um, all right, everyone. Thank you for attending and asking your great questions. And thank you, Atlas, for a great presentation. Awesome. Nicely done. And um, I'll go ahead. If you can, let's see, do I need to take control? Yes, I'm going to go ahead and take control. Okay, and perfect. I will go ahead then and end this webinar. Thanks again, everybody. Thank you again for having me.